Hello everybody and welcome back to Rebellious Menstruation. Uh, we're just going to do a quick unboxing uh, of Glad Rags. Um, this is a US company um, established in, it says on the box here, 1993. There we go. And uh, these are not the easiest to find in Australia without spending an excessive amount on uh, postage and handling so I got um, three of the sizes that were available that I could find um, these um, so this one here is a three count panty liner plus so they have a variety of different sizes that this is it says ultra soft reusable 100% cotton pads um, more information on the side. Um, it is also a certified B Corporation and has on here three colourful painting liners plus. And it says here using cloth pads, securely snap at the wings of your pad around your underwear and change your pad every two to six hours as needed and here is the contact information for them which is Portland Oregon and their email address oh, so on the back it has their pads so it has panty liners day pads and night pads um, the panty liners and day pads come in a regular and a plus size um, so this is the panty liner plus size So this comes with a user guide, okay, which we'll go through in a second. So this is how the panty liners look. They are in an amethyst colour, or this is what the company calls it, in an amethyst colour. Um, the tags are here. Um, so it has on the tag. 100% um, cotton exclusive of trim made in the US and the company logo on the back it has a pre soak in cold walker, water machine wash cold tumble dry at low or hang dry do not use chlorine bleach or fabric softener cold iron if desired um, just so you guys know if you guys are a bike rider and prefer bads, pads these are the type of clips that are quite often promoted as being good for bike riders because they're pretty flat on the um, they're pretty flat basically so those are the three liners this is the booklet um, on here it says follow these instructions carefully to ensure your glad rags cloth pads provide you with years of comfortable and eco-friendly period protection um, glad rags established 1993 safe simple smart period okay so it essentially tells you how to insert the holder and how to put it on it tells you how to clean it I'm assuming you guys can pause all of this and read it through if you would like. Um, so it basically says separate everything, rinse or soak in cold water um, or use the pre-soak function on your washing machine um, and change soaking water maximum 24 hours. Machine wash in cold water. Um, so remove pads and store flat to eliminate wrinkling and use cool iron if desired store your pads in a clean dry place to use next time this is proudly plastic free um, so and then it says a note about staining on this size it goes over their shapes again which is panty liner in regular and plus a day pad in regular and plus and a night pad and these come in a, a variety of organic or colorful patterns um, and then this is about their cup which is the exo flow 
on this side. That's their cup information. Okay, so that's that booklet. They are going to look at the Day Pad Plus. Um, the reason I selected these is because these are essentially this uh, Panty Liner Plus is about eight inches. Um, this is about I think eleven. It's eleven inches with a nine-inch core, I believe. So okay. Okay, this is the Day Pad Plus. Okay, so again, it's a clip. It has two inserts. So this is the organic cotton um, section. Um, so organic cotton, and this is how you fold it in. And the top. Okay, so um, initially, oh, um, I was, I'm not a particularly a big fan of this style of pad where essentially you are going to insert the insert into here. Okay, so for one, I think you can also include both um, and to make it kind of an extra heavy and then it clips around your underwear this way and that way you have it covered that way so um, but again kind of like a period underwear I thought if I don't give this a go I um, can't give uh, you guys a very honest review of these so um, the best thing to do is to get them and order them. Um, as you also will know I don't normally go for um, plain uh, packaging but this is the only colour that they had in Australia with this Day Pad Plus um, size so um, otherwise I would have got a color just like this amethyst one um, but I think they only had um, a day pad they had a day pad in colors and then the day pad plus were all sold out except for in this organic cotton um, color so um, that's just the reality of the situation I guess um, and this is the booklet which basically um, goes over again uh, cleaning care so um, as you can see from here this is the regular and it shows you the day pad and the day pad plus plus which is I think the uh, day pad is 10 inches with the insert being nine seven inches and the plus is 11 inches with the insert being 9 inches. So, um, yeah, so basically it goes over the cleaning guide, which is uh, separate, soak, and wash. And you can iron if you wish. Um, and then how to put them on. Okay, the last one is this night pad. Okay. Oops, and the booklet is still in here. So here's the booklet. So this is the night pad. This is in a lemon colour, as you can see. And this is some of the finer details. Okay. Um, these inserts here are apparently seven inches and um, I guess go this way I don't know there we go I guess I'm presuming that in this clips around oops I was not in your way so um, this is so I guess it's in the middle core bit here so that's an interesting way to design a heavy I mean for me I am a center bleeder anyway so I guess for me it does work out um, and again this is the booklet 
which goes over how to use cleaning um so it's kind of um oh, through this one back here so these are the two so this was the booklet in the liner and the heavy night pad and this was the booklet in the regular plus so i'm not sure if they're an old or a new one um but hey that's what's happening so this is the glad rags unboxing um what i might do is upload this um, and do a review of these later um i think uh in some of the other ones i've included the unboxing in um the review video and that video i think is kind of long so um, this video i might just um, upload this as an unboxing and then do a review later um, i do have um, some washing to do my cycle um, is due on friday um, and today is a monday so um, i'll probably do a load of um, washing on um, Monday or Wednesday probably um, and so that means that uh, I hopefully will be able to use these on Friday um, outside of that um, the usual implies applies sorry uh, enjoy your uh, morning afternoon or evening depending on where you are in the day and I of course will catch up with you all in the next video Bye, everyone.